Well, uh, a front page story in the USA Today today um, brings up this, the um, subject of, of birth defects. The title is Holy Hobbits, Small Beings are a Huge Find. Of course, back in 2003, and this information is in the book uh, Epigenetics, um, are what were called the hobbits in a little island of Flores in the Pacific and in Indonesia. And these hobbits are like the size of a, a kindergartner, you know, just weighing 40 pounds and, and uh, maybe two and a half feet, three foot tall kind of thing. Men having these three foot tall, two and a half feet tall. And their heads were half the size that you would expect even in a, a midget or a dwarf of that size. The heads were half the size, microencephaly. Now, the first fossils uh, found in 2003 by museum uh, curators and workers were dated back to 50,000 to 100,000 years ago. Okay, and so that throws things up in the air because if you're biblically oriented, people say 5,000 years, the Earth is only 5,000 years old. But then geologists say the Earth is billions of years old. So they're dating these 200, 2003 um, hobbits back to uh, 50,000 to 100,000 years ago. And then 2014, another group was found in a different area of the island of Flores um, in a section called Mata Mengi or Menge, depending on whether you're French or German, um, 700,000, almost a million years old, mm -hmm. and just as tiny as the original hobbits, which is reported in 2003 in the journal Nature. Okay, now, these were Stone Age people for thousands of years. They never... Um, uh, developed iron tools. But the interesting, the most interesting thing in the article was it said they are descendants of much taller people. Hello? They are descendants of much smaller people. And so what I'm proposing here, this is a possibility. Okay, this is a possibility that these were um, birth defects in, the, in these taller people with microencephaly and undersized and um, they're still fertile, and so they were able to survive. The, the parents loved them and cuddled them and, and took care of them and taught them things, and survival things. And with the help of these taller people over time, they survived, but the taller people died out, maybe because the hobbits could live on one bean a day and, and the taller people needed a, a quart of beans a day, so to speak. Okay? And because of their smaller size um, and, and simple life and no big predators and that sort of thing on the Isle of Flores, uh, they were able to survive and flourish. Okay, so um, this is a very interesting piece of information here because I don't think the Zika virus, uh, which is what the medical system is blaming the appearance of um, uh, the microencephaly defect uh, for, and of course in August, I think it was, or July or August of 2015, uh, there was uh, 4,000 babies born in Sao Paulo, Brazil, with what was called microencephaly. And was that sort of an experiment with a new morning sickness pill, kind of like thalidomide? And that was the result? Or was there something in the water like Flint, Michigan? Or was it the Zika virus? Well, I think it was something else other than the Zika virus, and we'll find out eventually. I want you to understand that all birth defects, all birth defects are preventable with nutrition. 90 essential nutrients, 16 minerals, 16 vitamins, 12 amino acids, 3 fatty acids, and we're talking about cleft palates. We're talking about cleft lips. We're talking about limb defects, too many fingers, not enough fingers, short limbs, missing limbs, like we found in uh, the thalidomide babies, which interfered with the nutrition of the developing embryo. Heart defects, muscular dystrophy, a simple mineral deficiency, um, cystic fibrosis, a simple mineral deficiency. Okay, Down syndrome, a simple mineral deficiency. Spina bifida, a simple deficiency of a vitamin, folic acid. All birth defects have been eliminated in animals, both zoo animals, many, many species. Now, that was part of the project I did back in the 1967 to the mid-70s and did my 20,000 autopsies and included 17,000 and some change of over 454 species of zoo animals and 3,000 humans. I was looking for pollution as a causative factor a contributing causative factor to um, deaths from what we'd call natural causes, which would include birth defects and so on, and found that these were all due to nutritional deficiencies. And with the information gleaned in that, and by the way, the 1,200-page book that came out of the, that study 
which was funded by the National Institutes of Health. I was the pathologist. There weren't any other pathologists. I was the pathologist on the project. And um, that book is in the Smithsonian uh, Institute today. If you um, check them out of a medical library, you have to leave an $1,800 deposit for that book. And if you buy one new, it's $25,000. Okay, the information is so valuable. They would have to spend over a billion dollars, maybe close to $2 billion to redo that study that I did in 1967 to the mid-70s, okay? 75 scientific papers came out of it, many books, including the big one, which is in the Smithsonian Institute. Well, I'm here to tell you that if you get the book Epigenetics, The Death of the Genetic Theory of Disease Transmission, the book Dead Doctors Don't Lie, the DVD and the CD book, uh, okay, Dead Doctors Don't Lie, and the book Rare Earth Spin Cures, and learn how to prevent these birth defects. Many of them are reversible even after the baby's born, like cystic fibrosis and muscular dystrophy. Contact your young DV associate today. Get epigenetics. Dead doctors don't lie on rare earth ventures. And we'll be back with dead doctors don't lie after these messages. Okay, Doug, what pearls of wisdom do you have for us today? Well, I thought we'd talk a bit about an article that I saw. And when I, I saw this thing, I was kind of not really that surprised, but I was a little shocked. And this came from Fox News. And the headline reads, a single pill could prevent heart disease, diabetes, other illnesses simultaneously. And the author of the article says, when it comes to health, I'm skeptical of willpower. says, I look for, uh, when it comes to the whole uh, population's health, I look for big fixes more than small acts of will. And it tells the story of two friends that are physicians, both in their 60s, and they decided to start taking a preventative measure uh, of medications that were called uh, poly pills. And apparently these are medications where there's several different uh, active ingredients and they go on to say that uh, these guys adopted this as part of their personal health regime. And they say a poly pill might include any uh, of several things, a baby aspirin, a statin to rebalance cholesterol, a drug to control blood pressure, and one to lower blood sugar. They say there's one version actually available right now online. And they say doses are so low that it's relatively safe. It's like a multivitamin. But with serious medications, some public health advocates now argue that everyone over the age of 50 should be on one of these poly pills. They say you should, I said, you read that right, everyone. If we had perfect, uh, healthy lifestyles, the drugs wouldn't be needed, but we don't. And even if we did, the drugs might add further protection. And they go on to say uh, a review of the research on poly pills came from uh, Melvin uh, Leifber, a uh, researcher at the University Medical Center in Utrecht in the Netherlands, and this was all published in uh, Hypertension Reports, and they say they found a reason to think that the treatment might help higher-risk individuals and urged more clinical trials. They said if moderate and high-risk people benefit the idea of uh, offering treatment to everyone older than 50 uh, years might raise widespread interest, they wrote. The poly pill they concluded could be an important tool to reduce the risk of cardiovascular disease and make it more likely that patients take the necessary drugs. So now they're advocating that they put everybody on some sort of drug. I just think it's insane. Well, it is insane, but if you look at it deeper, this comes from looking at what we're doing, okay? Uh, we are in the Netherlands. We are in 55 countries, including Europe and Eastern Europe and Scandinavia. And so they, they're knowing what we're doing, okay? And they say, well, why would we let Wallach make a program that has all 90 essential nutrients in it and deal with 900 different diseases? We need to get a program out there with one pill. And remember, the doses are low because otherwise, if the doses were what they prescribe with each drug by itself, the pill would be as big as a golf ball. Okay, and so uh, instead of giving somebody 27 pills, which becomes cumbersome and, and um, uh, oh, which they say uncomfortable, and they're just, oh, God, i got to take my pills with me. I'm going to be gone for two days kind of thing. Uh, they're trying to lower the doses, get it all into one pill, so people just pop that stuff. And, of course, they're thinking, and, and they came close, and they said, it's like a multivitamin. All right, and so they're seeing the advantages to what we're doing here but they want to keep it on their rails instead of jumping on our rails. And so they're trying to give people the same sort of um, results that we're getting from their poly pill. But it ain't going to happen because a poly pill would have to be as big as, a, like I say, a golf ball to deal with the symptoms. It doesn't really get 
to the basic cause of things, but to the symptoms. So stick with your 90, 60 minerals, 16 vitamins, 12 amino acids, 3 fatty acids. Get the 90 essential nutrients. Get the book Epigenetics. Dead Doctors Don't Lie. The only time they won't. And Rare Earths Vin Cures. And we'll be back with Dead Doctors Don't Lie after these messages. Okay, Doug, let's go to callers. Let's head to Iowa, and Margie, you're on with Dr. Wallach. Well, Margie, you're, you're on the air. Hi. Oh, hi, Dr. Wallach. Thank you for taking my call. Um, on May 20th, I, I broke down and I, and I bought your Healthy Body Pack, and I started the program mostly mm-hmm. because I've, I've got osteoarthritis. I've just got diagnosed with rheumatoid arthritis. A little history here. I've had cancer four times and just a boatload of stuff. And frankly, I just got sick of feeling like crap. So I bought the, the Healthy Body Pack. And here's the issue. Um, I'm getting headaches very consistently within minutes of taking mm-hmm. the product. Okay. Well, first of all, what do you weigh, Margie? Uh, currently, I am 157, and I'm five foot one. Okay. So you're 57 pounds overweight. Okay. Uh, pretty cool. I'm, I've got a big bone structure, so yeah, we're, uh, we're close. <laughs> Forty-five to fifty, fifty-seven pounds overweight. Okay. Um, what type of cancer do you have? You have skin cancer, lung cancer, uterine cancer. What do you have? No, uh, I had cancer, oral cancer, inside my right cheek uh, a few times, and then it migrated out, and they found it in the lymph nodes on the same side, and wound up doing a full flap reconstruction. Okay. Now, did you chew tobacco or smoke or? No, no. They told me I was, they don't know why somebody like me would have gotten cancer. They said I'm in the less than one percentile for this particular type of cancer. They just didn't know mm-hmm. why. Okay, do you eat processed meats like pastrami and pepperoni and those kinds of things? No, but I, I do like bacon. Now, after having listened to you uh, for a while, I've laid off the bacon. Well, there there is your trouble, okay? okay. I was eating bacon on a regular basis two, three days a week will increase your risk of oral and throat cancer and lung cancer is the same as smoking two packs of cigarettes a day. Wow. Even if you haven't smoked. So it's the bacon. Okay. So um, this is a Char thing. Char, are you there? I'm here. Okay. We have a nice lady here who is five foot one, 157 pounds. She's had a history of oral cancer with, with metastasis to the regional lymph nodes in her neck. And... Um, she has osteoarthritis and rheumatoid arthritis. What would you do for her? Well, okay, first I'd get her on a gluten-free diet. Mm-hmm. Then I'd get her on, she probably should take two healthy bone and joint packs. And then for okay, the- wait, whoa, whoa, wait a minute. we got to run to that message moment here. So hang on. Hang on, Margie. And we will be back with you after these messages. Okay, Doug, let's go right back to Iowa and Margie. And, Shar, you just uh, got done saying stay away from the fried foods and the processed meats and the oils and the gluten, all the bad stuff. Right. And um, go ahead again with what uh, program you'd give Margie. Okay, because she's had cancer so many times, I'd give her two healthy brain and heart packs. And for the arthritis, I'd give her the glucogel. And then for the rheumatoid arthritis, I would give her the, um, the uh, killer biotic. Very good. You get an A+. Plus. Okay, uh, Margie, Char is uh, exactly correct. I'd have you go ahead with two of the healthy brain and heart packs because it's got the selenium in each one of those, so you'll be taking three selenium twice a day with the two healthy brain and heart packs. That supports your immune system when you have a history of cancer. And it's one of my lawsuits against the FDA in which I uh, actually prevailed where by supplementing with selenium you can reduce your risk of, of several different types of cancer. And... Um, uh, also, with the OsteoFX Plus and both of those, it's going to support and promote healthy uh, maintenance repair of the cartilage and ligaments and tendons, connective tissue, and the bone matrix. But throwing in the two large bottles of glucogel, as Char says, it's also going to support and promote healthy maintenance repair of the cartilage and ligaments and tendons, connective tissue, disc between the vertebrae. 
And when you take the killer biotic, I'd go ahead and get three bottles of those to begin with, three bottles a month for two or three months, and then cut it down to two bottles a month for sort of all the time. And you will be able to uh, get um, uh, 20 of those a day, okay? Uh, five at breakfast, five at lunch, five at dinner, five at bedtime. And uh, very important because rheumatoid arthritis is an infection when you have bone-to-bone arthritis, okay? So, again, the killer biotic, I may have made a mistake there. The killer biotic, I'd take three, three times a day. It'd be three bottles a month of the killer biotic, three, three times a day, three at breakfast, three at lunch, three at dinner. The glucogel is five, three times a day. And um, this is to support your body's immune system to attack the bugs. And two of those eight herbs in the killer biotic also have antimicrobial properties, and so they do kill bacteria, viruses, fungus, and yeast. Give us a call every two weeks. You can start the diet immediately. In Iowa, it'll take you maybe four or five working days to get your product and uh, contact your local Young Givity associate. And uh, if you don't have one, you can stay on, and Doug will guide you in the right direction and so forth. At any rate, uh, Doug, let's go to another caller. All right, let's head to Tennessee. And Calvin, you're on with Dr. Wallach. No, well, Calvin, you're on the air. Yes, sir. Thank you for taking my call. I had a question that I was going to ask about edema, but I just met a guy, and I'm on my lunch break now, and I want to ask about this guy here. He's, I just found out this guy has a 10-pound tumor on his uh, kidney, and I was wanted to see what you would suggest. And, and, and even if you knew maybe what could cause something like that, but mainly a protocol that this guy could use. Okay. Did they tell him this was a malignant or benign tumor? That, I don't know. I didn't really get that much information from the guy. He just said he was doing a little uh, chemo. They were trying to shrink it, and he's supposed to have surgery later on, uh, I think, either mm-hmm. next month, I think, he said. But I'm not so sure about that. Yeah, do you have any, do you have any, well, if they're using chemo, they're talking about being malignant. And, of course, um, kidney cancer is one of the uh, ones that you can really do a good job of cure if you get it before it gets out of that capsule and moves the lymph nodes to other places. You take out that kidney and that tumor, uh, oftentimes it will result in a cure. But hang on, we'll be back. We'll give you an idea. We need to know this guy's weight and height. He has any other issues when we come back. And we'll be back with Dead Doctors Don't Lie for these messages. Okay, Doug, we're going right back to Tennessee. And Calvin has a friend with a 10-pound tumor in his kidney. And let's see here. Uh, Calvin, you know this fellow's height and weight? He's around 6'1", and I'm just going to round it off. Probably He's probably closer to 280 than he is 250, somewhere between 270 to 300. I'm not there okay. where he is right now, so I'm just going to say 280. Okay well, that, okay, well, that just tells us he's bigger than 200 pounds. Okay, so that's good. So we're going to give you the ideal here, and we, we may have to change that depending on what he tells us about the nature of that tumor. But the fact that they're giving him chemotherapy tells me that they believe that it's a malignant tumor. And so, um, Char, what would you do for this guy? 280 pounds. Give him the ideal program. Obviously, if, if uh, his wallet can't afford it, he can go down to two. But he needs three of everything. So what would you give him? i give him three healthy brain and heart packs. Okay. And, and then I would also give him a Fucoy Z, and I would give him Ocean's Gold. And I would give him the BTT 2.0 tablets for the org points. That's, and okay, I'd that's also, perfect. And I'd also okay. give him uh, Oxybody. Okay. So Oxybody is a liquid. He would need three quarts a month, an ounce, a half hour to an hour before each meal. So it's uh, three quarts a month. Uh, three of the healthy brain and heart packs. That will give him nine of the selenium a day, three at breakfast, lunch, and dinner, plus a full dose of everything else at breakfast, lunch, and dinner. The Ocean's Gold, I'd give him nine of those tablets a day, three at breakfast, three at lunch, three at dinner. That's for the sea cucumber that's in there. That's three bottles a month that supports the immune system. The BTT 2.0, the, the uh, tablets, not the crystals, are going to be in the health and heart pack. But the tablets, um, you could take three of those three times a day. So it'll be three bottles a month. And the purpose here is to get the auric points, or oxygen rack absorption capacity, above 300, this would give him 320,000 auric points a day, which is going to support uh, his immune system. And it won't hurt for him also to lose weight. If Again, if finances aren't a problem, I would have him throw in um, a bottle a month of the, what would you give him for his weight? ASAP. ASAP, you're exactly right there. Uh, as slim as possible, as soon as possible. And since uh, he needs to lose about 80 pounds, 
I'd give him start out with one bottle a month because all these minerals and everything are going to help him. Those things alone will help him lose maybe a half a pound a day or more. And so to really steam it up and get him up to two pounds a day, half a pound to two pounds a day in weight loss, um, throw in the ASAP, uh, one bottle, let's start out there, and have him put a dropper full, not a drop, but a dropper full under his tongue, 30 minutes for each meal, and let it absorb through his oral tissues. And, and after a couple of days, he'll begin to lose a half pound, two pounds a day. And then again, as the doctors tell us more information, make sure we get that feedback. In either case, let us know what's going on every two weeks, and we can walk you guys through this. Okay, Doug, let's go to callers. All right, let's head to Florida. Ed, David, you're on with Dr. Wallach. Well, David, you're on the air. Thank you for taking my call, Dr. Wallach. It's an honor to see you. Yes, sir. I'm uh, calling on behalf of a friend of mine who's a minister of the Christian faith. He has cancer of the stomach. He's an African-American, uh, 186 pounds, 5 foot 9 inches, and he's 65 years old. He's had a series of chemotherapy, and he's lost 5 pounds in the last week. Okay, so he's been on chemotherapy. And do you know what stage this cancer is? Is it metastasized, or they just find it and still in the stomach? Or I think they had to cut part of his stomach out. Mm-hmm. Okay. Any other issues that you know of? High blood pressure, diabetes, heart disease? No, not that I know of. The main focus was on the part of the cancer. Mm-hmm. Okay. So again, this could be a short thing. 186 pounds, five foot nine. Did I get that right? Five foot nine. Mm-hmm. That's correct. Yeah. Okay. And he has a history of chemotherapy and some of the stomach removed surgically because of stomach cancer. What would you do for this guy, Shar? Well, I give my gluten free diet, of course, and then mm-hmm. I would give him two healthy brain and heart packs and the same thing: the sea cucumber, the the uh, cucoid Z, and he could take the oxybody too, and then the BTT two point tablets for the org points. Okay, there you go. And so, again, David, your friend, um, Ashar said, and you may have to grind up the pills and tablets and put them in some jello or something like that or, or put them in some um, homemade ice cream made out of our Slender FX um, shake, and you can throw in some eggs and make it out of heavy whipping cream so he doesn't lose any weight and blend it up and freeze it and make him nibble on it as an ice cream. That's the way to get all these supplements in him. And, of course, the OxyBody, he could have an ounce of that, um, 30 minutes to an hour before each of his three meals, or two meals, so you'd have uh, two to three quarts a month, depending on his wallet. Um, uh, two healthy brain and heart packs, as we said. Also, uh, two bottles of the Ocean's Gold, so you could take three of those twice a day for the sea cucumber, which supports the immune system. The Fucoid Z um, has the um, Fucoidin in it, which comes from red marine algae and supports the immune system. That's one of the, there's over 800 studies on this stuff. Um, by universities. That's why the Japanese, they say, uh, have uh, 10% of the cancer rate we do it and much more um, better survival rate than we do because this fucoidin comes from red marine algae. So we like that stuff. And then um, the, the, for the auric points, to get his auric points up, um, he needs three of the three or four of the um, Beyond Tangerine BTT 2.0 tablets, which is in addition to everything else, and uh, that'll increase his auric points, his antioxidant points, above 300,000. And so give us a call every couple of weeks to let us know when you find out more as time goes on. Every time he gets a report from the doctor, pass it on to us, and we can walk you guys through this. Okay, let's see here. we got time to do another one here, Doug. We can get one started. Let's head to Illinois and another David. You're on with Dr. Wallach. David, you're on the air. Yes, Dr. Wallach. Thank you for taking my call. And uh... Yes, sir. Thank you for helping us to help all these people to have a better life, sir. Well, you're very kind. How can we help you? Yes, I have a gentleman, 55 years old, seven, I mean, five, five, seven, and 174 pounds. He's type two diabetes, and um, he's told after his lab work that his um, kidneys are spilling protein at 480, whatever that count is. Mm-hmm. When it should be 30, according to what he yep. was told. How can we help? Okay, that? so, but, but he's not on dialysis yet, correct? Or is he on dialysis? No, 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 no. God forbid. Not yes. Okay. All right. Again, this is a Char thing. 174 pound guy, type 2 diabetes, has got the beginnings of some kidney failure going on here. Oh, one other thing, David. Does he have high blood pressure? No. No, he used to, okay. but not anymore. 
Okay, now is he on medication for high blood pressure? No, no, he, he does, he's not taking any medication for it. Okay. How did he get rid of his high blood pressure? Uh, Doc, I have no idea. Hmm. Okay, yeah, yeah. if you would, inquire for me. Okay, Char, what would you give this guy? Um, uh, he's got some kidney stuff going on here. He has type 2 diabetes, and he weighs 174 pounds. What would you give him? I would get, First of all, I'd get him on a gluten-free diet, but then I would give him two healthy blood sugar packs. And then I would also give him, for the kidney problem, I would give him the, uh, uh, okay, I hear music. <laughs> Classic, three twice a day, two bottles a month. Yeah. And make sure that he checks his fasting blood sugar, David, before he medicates himself, because his blood sugar will drop. And then call us every two weeks, let us know what's going on. And, uh, and next time he has a kidney test, tell us the answer there. We'll be back after these messages. We're back with Dead Doctors Don't Lie on the ZBS Radio Network. Dr. Joel Wallach here for Young Jimmy and 90 for Life Crusade. And Doug, let's go to callers. Let's go to Hawaii. And Diane, you're on with Dr. Wallach. Hello, Diane. You're on the air. Hi, Dr. Wallach. Um, Aloha. I'd like, to, I'd like to know what you recommend for detoxing heavy metal poisoning. Okay. Uh, is this yourself or this is a general question? Myself. Okay. What do you weigh? I weigh 150. I'm 5'9". Okay, and how did you determine you have heavy metal poisoning? Um, hair analysis and a skin scanner. Okay, and what heavy metals uh, do you have? The highest are cadmium and mercury from having my mercury fillings removed. Okay, all right. Uh, Shar, you want to go for this one? Yes, well, mercury, the antidote to mercury poisoning is selenium. That'll take care of that. Okay. And cadmium, uh, you do the same thing when you have lead poisoning. What would you give for that? Uh, calcium. Perfect. You get an A+. Plus. And so, at 150 pounds, I would kind of dose yourself, Diana, uh, for um, 200 pounds because you have a, a, a situation here. And so I would go ahead and take uh, two healthy brain and heart packs per month. Okay, full dose for thing twice a day, which would include three selenium twice a day, which, as uh, Char said, uh, selenium is legendary for being the, um, which I say, the, the opposite of mercury. When you take lots of selenium, it, it helps displace the, the mercury. And cadmium, you take extra calcium, so I'd go and get an extra uh, bottle of the osteo, as Char says, so you'll get one bottle of osteo with each of the healthy brain and heart packs, and you'll have a third bottle of osteo here by itself, so you can take one ounce of the osteo with, three times a day or one ounce of breakfast, one ounce of dinner, one ounce of bedtime, whatever's more convenient for you. Obviously, you need to make sure you're, you stop the source of these things. And uh, you want to, uh, what would you do for a general detox every day for a while and get the hair analysis char like every three months and see how that lead and, and, and uh, mercury and cadmium levels are coming? Uh, what would you, what kind of a general detox thing would you give her in addition? Rainforest. Exactly, A++. Herbal Rainforest, it has 14 cleansing herbs, which are legendary in old herbal terms for cl cleansing the liver, the blood, and the colon. Okay, and so uh, I would take, uh, as your body weight, I'd take a tablespoon of the Herbal Rainforest at bedtime. It tastes good. Kids love it. It's peachy flavor, peachy keen, as they say. And so I would go ahead and take a, a tablespoon, which is a half ounce, so that one bottle of Herbal Rainforest will last you two months. And, um, you know, I like to take it every day when I'm around the home or someplace where I have uh, distributors been with here while they know that I want that herbal rainforest because I fly so much and, and I have so much exposure to chemicals and airplanes and, and so forth and travel. And so that's a good thing to do. Then give us a call next time to get a hair analysis. You should get one every three months until all these toxic metal levels get down into the safe levels. And uh, let's start there. And how much time we have here, Doug? Yeah, you got a little less than 60 seconds. A little less than 60 seconds. 
Okay, Shar, quick question. Yeah. Um, do you have do you have any um, secondary education? Do you have any community college or any university on health stuff or biology? No, nothing on health. Okay. But did you have any continuing education courses, you know, in community college or university? I took a welding course. That was in high school, wasn't it? No, well, I, no, I took it after I was out of school. Well, right after you graduated high school, okay. Yep. And so the point that I want to get at here is you didn't have to take any special medical courses to learn all this stuff. How did you learn all this stuff? From you. How did, well, I'm not around you all the time, so how did you learn it from me? Oh, the books and the CDs. I oh, yeah. Yeah. And so you listen to the CDs over and over and over and over and over. And yep. I know you in your library you have all my books, and uh, I'm assuming you just didn't buy them, that you did read them. Yep, and I... And you, you've been... That's go ahead. That's how I learned, really. Okay, and so we're urging everybody else to do what Char does. Listen to those CDs, read the books, and, uh, you know, call your associate that you're associated with and learn how to do all this and help us, and we'll pay you an obscene amount of money. Okay. Thank you, Char. Super job. Thank you, Doug and Richard. Superlative job as usual. God bless each and every one of you. God bless our troops. God bless our Navy SEALs. And God bless America. Hi, everyone. Andy Anderson here. Are you using those handy little bottles of gel that zap germs, bacteria, and other nasties? In today's world, that's smart, especially with all the filthy doorknobs, shopping carts, and handrails we touch every day. Here's what you may not know. Once the alcohol evaporates, goodbye effectiveness. No more protection until you use it again. Pure works to the rescue. Our FDA-compliant foam, lotion, soap, and spray do not rely on alcohol. Their killing power lasts up to four hours. Pure Work Disinfecting Spray is EPA certified to kill swine flu, bird flu, MRSA, HIV, hepatitis B and C, and a whole host of viruses and bacteria, mold and fungus too. It's even safe around children and pets. You'll love the soft feel of Pure Works on your hand. It actually conditions that will not dry your skin. Here's a little peace of mind knowing your hands are still germ-free hours later. Get your hands on Pure Works and get Pure Works on your hands. Stand by. Pull out your paper and pencil for your local number to order Pure Works. Fish has been thought of as a brain food for eons, but it's not the fish that's key. It's actually the essential fatty acids, EFAs, or omega-3s found in fish, called essential because they're necessary for good health and your body can't make them. So they must be consumed through diet or supplementation. Longevity has developed the perfect supplement in SmartFX, an acronym for Sustained Memory and Retrieval Time, a concentration of DHA and EPA, both members of the omega-3 family. Supporting neural path function and cardiovascular health for optimal mental concentration, awareness, focus, and agility. If you've got a mentally demanding career, you're a student crunching for the big test, or just want to maintain health for a sense of well-being, try SmartFX from Longevity. If you'd like to learn more about nutritional supplementation, call your local Longevity associate. And don't forget to ask about home-based business opportunities. In recent years, several studies have discovered the healthy benefits of drinking coffee. Longevity has now taken it a step further with an entire product line of healthy coffees from Longevity's JavaFit selection of top-shelf gourmet coffees. All JavaFit coffees are made from 100% premium, hand-selected Arakaba coffee beans grown in the finest regions of Latin America. All are carefully roasted, creating a delicious, rich, full-bodied flavor. For an extra boost, try JavaFit's Energy Extreme 62, a proprietary blend of nutrients including Cambogia, green tea extract, an extra shot of caffeine, and niacin. Designed to support metabolism and enhance physical performance. Available in single cup or single pot packs. Contact your local Longevity distributor to get Javolution coffees. And don't forget to ask about the home-based business opportunity. You've listened to physician and veterinarian Dr. Joel Wallach help many people on the Dead Doctors Don't Lie talk radio program. You've also heard hundreds of people tell how Dr. Wallach and Longevity products have changed their lives. If you're now convinced that Dr. Wallach is onto something and you want to try Longevity's premium quality products for yourself, we can connect you with a distributor that serves your local area. Simply call our special helpline voicemail at 313 444 3463. That's 313 444 
888-382-3463. Call right now and leave your name, telephone number, or email address, and we'll see to it that the right person contacts you shortly. Remember, the phone number, 313-444-3463. That's 313-444-3463. Call now to change your life. That's 313-444-3463. Fish has been thought of as a brain food for eons. But it's not the fish that's key. It's actually the essential fatty acids, EFAs, or omega-3s found in fish. Called essential because they're necessary for good health and your body can't make them. So they must be consumed through diet or supplementation. Longevity has developed the perfect supplement in SmartFX, an acronym for Sustained Memory and Retrieval Time, a concentration of DHA and EPA. Both members of the omega-3 family, supporting neural path function and cardiovascular health for optimal mental concentration, awareness, focus, and agility. If you've got a mentally demanding career, you're a student crunching for the big test, or just want to maintain health for a sense of well-being, try Smart FX from Longevity. If you'd like to learn more about nutritional supplementation, call your local Longevity associate, and don't forget to ask about home-based business opportunities. In recent years, several studies have discovered the healthy benefits of drinking coffee. Longevity has now taken it a step further with an entire product line of healthy coffees from Longevity's JavaFit selection of top-shelf gourmet coffees. All JavaFit coffees are made from 100% premium, hand-selected Arakaba coffee beans grown in the finest regions of Latin America. All are carefully roasted, creating a delicious, rich, full-bodied flavor. For an extra boost, try JavaFit's Energy Extreme 62, a proprietary blend of nutrients including cambogia, green tea extract, an extra shot of caffeine, and niacin. Designed to support metabolism and enhance physical performance. Available in single cup or single pot packs. Contact your local Longevity distributor to get Javolution coffees. And don't forget to ask about the home-based business opportunity. You've listened to physician and veterinarian Dr. Joel Wallach help many people on the Dead Doctors Don't Lie talk radio program. You've also heard hundreds of people tell how Dr. Wallach and Longevity products have changed their lives. If you're now convinced that Dr. Wallach is onto something and you want to try Longevity's premium quality products for yourself, we can connect you with a distributor that serves your local area. Simply call our special helpline voicemail at 313 444 3463. That's 313-444-3463. Call right now and leave your name, telephone number, or email address, and we'll see to it that the right person contacts you shortly. Remember, the phone number, 313-444-3463. That's 313-444-3463. Call now to change your life. That's 313-444-3463. You've listened to physician and veterinarian Dr. Joel Wallach help many people on the Dead Doctors Don't Lie talk radio program. You've also heard hundreds of people tell how Dr. Wallach and Longevity products have changed their lives. If you're now convinced that Dr. Wallach is onto something and you want to try Longevity's premium quality products for yourself, we can connect you with a distributor that serves your local area. Simply call our special helpline voicemail at 313 444 3463. That's 313-444-3463. Call right now and leave your name, telephone number, or email address, and we'll see to it that the right person contacts you shortly. Remember, the phone number, 313-444-3463. That's 313-444-3463. Call now to change your life. That's 313 444 Hi, this is Dr. Joel Wallach, your host of Dead Doctors Don't Lie. If you're interested in a colon cleanse, blood cleanse, liver cleanse, you know, in the classical herbal way, you want to ask your longevity associate for Herbal Rainforest. Herbal Rainforest has 16 herbs, 
16 cleansing herbs, classic cleansing herbs, and 77 plant minerals. That's right, and these are all organic. It doesn't get any better than that. In your busy day, and you're around all these toxins out there in your workplace, on the way home, going to work, in your food, in the air, in the water, you need herbal rainforest. I guarantee you, it will give you a cleanse. You can control the dose. It's a liquid. It tastes good. It doesn't get any better than this. A colon that's happy makes you happy. Nothing better than a happy colon. Herbal rainforest. Clean it out. For more information on this product or others you've heard about on the Dead Doctors Don't Lie radio program, call your local Longevity associate today. And don't forget to ask about home-based business opportunities. Greetings, everyone. Judy DeVilbus here. What do you think of when you hear the words tangy tangerine? Well, I think of like a sweet, tangy tasting something. Well, what I'm referring to is the ultimate tangy tangerine. It's a fantastic product. It has everything you need, and a great benefit is it's very, very delicious. It's very easy to drink. I've suggested it even to youngsters. Even children like it. Even little guys. Even little girls. They come right into my office. Their parents can't get them to take those chewable and besides that, they're not as good as tangy tangerine. And I give them a little taste of that, and you know something? They're pleased as punch. So, if it's good for a child, and it tastes delicious, why not you? There's no excuse not to take a vitamin when it tastes as good as that does. So how about it? Tangy tangerine should be the answer to all of your nutritional program problems. For more information, or to order, call your Longevity distributor today. And don't forget to ask about Longevity home-based business opportunities. You've listened to physician and veterinarian Dr. Joel Wallach help many people on the Dead Doctors Don't Lie talk radio program. You've also heard hundreds of people tell how Dr. Wallach and Longevity products have changed their lives. If you're now convinced that Dr. Wallach is onto something and you want to try Longevity's premium quality products for yourself, we can connect you with a distributor that serves your local area. Simply call our special helpline voicemail at 313 444 3463. That's 313-444-3463. Call right now and leave your name, telephone number, or email address, and we'll see to it that the right person contacts you shortly. Remember, the phone number, 313-444-3463. That's 313-444-3463. Call now to change your life. That's 313 444 3463. I am Judy DeVilbus. Here I am speaking to you again. I just wanted to tell you that recently I started drinking the whey shakes again, the chocolate whey shake. And you need to remember the whey shake isn't just for losing weight. It's a fantastic place to get your great protein. And if you're trying to gain weight, you can take it along with your meals. And the best part is if you want to just have a great protein shake, do like I do. Put it over ice, stir it up, and you can sip on it for 20 minutes to an hour. I do it every single day. I absolutely love it. You need to get back to it, too. It's really good for you. And it makes not fat, but it makes muscle after you work out. And you can also mix it up in a blender with an egg, and you have the most incredible health protein shake. Or mix it with a little water, stir it up, and you have a little pudding. And who doesn't like pudding? For more information or to order, call your Longevity distributor today. And don't forget to ask about Longevity home-based business opportunities.